Yes, yeah, big class today. Bunch of people with dogs. There's a little rip right there. There's our rip. Getting some training. Slow your pace. Tell your dogs easy. <laughs> Real pretty fall day. Beautiful weather. About 62. Yeah, this is pretty cool, you guys. Uh, good, good for training the dogs. So the dog behaves. Instead of the dog uh, running you, you run the dog. This is good for people to understand it and own dogs. Especially dogs that misbehave, so they don't end up in the end of getting rid of dogs because they didn't train the dog properly to teach the dog to behave. There's some pretty crazy dogs here that were are, uh, rescues. That very first dog down at the very end is a rescue, and he's got a lot of anxiety and he does a lot of weird stuff. came down the trail and freaked out this dog. This first dog had some issues. He's a rescue and they're trying to settle him down and train him. They use prong collars. It works really well with them. And they only put them on when they're training. It's like the mother's bite on their neck. So they uh, feel that and they listen to you. Teaching about temper tantrums. If you remain calm, remain relaxed, and the dog won't have a temper tantrum. This dog here is named Sam. He's two years old. I think Rip's going to end up about his size. He's pretty big, very good dog. These people, uh, this is their first time getting their training. So we're thinking Rip's going to be a little bigger like this dog. This dog's close to 100 pounds. Rip's about 82. you guys I just thought I'd show you four or five minutes of this in case anybody's any interested I'll post it and uh, put it up there I know it might be a little long but in case you're interested it's just kind of cool it's something we did on a Saturday just to continue to train the dog um, we do stuff every weekend tomorrow we got a big Bronco op deal we're doing um, so but yep um, I'll let you guys go
and uh, I'll post this and see you guys later. Thanks for watching.